choosing Case Western Reserve University was an interesting decision for me just because I knew I wanted to play collegiate baseball and I knew I wanted to continue on with that. But during my senior year of uh, high school, I suffered a uh, injury, a labrum surgery. So my recruiting process got <clears throat> delayed a little bit. And so I did primarily most of it in the fall of my senior year. And I was recruited by the coaches at Case. And originally, I had no idea what Case Western Reserve was. Um, I thought it was a military school at first. And I was like, oh, no, no shot, I'm going there. Um, but then once doing the research and once looking into the academics, the athletics, and just what Case Western stands for as a whole, uh, it grabbed my attention immediately. Then uh, coming on my visit and seeing the campus and seeing how it is in a major city, but it also has a close college knit feel to it uh, that really appealed to me and appealed to kind of what I was searching for in the college process. So I think there was a multitude of reasons, but overall, I think understanding that academically, I was gonna come to one of the best institutions in the country, get a great four year degree, be set up to go to medical school as I'm pursuing now, um, and then also have a great athletics experience. I think that was really the major decision maker for me uh, in choosing Case. I really have appreciated my experience because of the inclusivity and how we've always tried to take diverse perspectives into consideration. Um, for example, over this past 2020 year and coming into 2021, there are def different initiatives that we have pushed and some of the organizations that we've now founded on campus to give black um, student athletes uh, the ability to voice their opinions and really be seen and known on campus. So one of the organizations that we just recently founded is called Black BLAC. So this is an organization that me and a few other student athletes have founded that gives us as student athletes the opportunity to embrace our culture and embrace the, um, the differences that we may have in order to bring about education, bring about inclusive, inclusive, inclusiveness, excuse me, um, and just allowing that allowing black student athletes to feel welcome and have a support group here on campus. I remember my thought process and one was trying to play for the best athletic program that I could possibly play for. I know I had the aspiration and dreams to play division one baseball. Um, but then as I went through my recruiting process and realized that college is more about just your athletic experience. I think sometimes we get very caught into making a decision strictly based off of athletics. I think you need to take a holistic approach to it and realize the degree that you are going to be pursuing and what you want to major in or what you want to do professionally um, in the future. So my, my pitch would be consider yourself 10 years from now. Um, consider what you want to pursue in life. Consider your goals and aspirations and then make a holistic approach um, to where you want to go to college and consider things beyond your sports career because you can only play a sport for so long, even the best of the best. Um, so consider what's your degree, what kind of weight that will carry after your college experience.